What's up, Wayne Barron here with Dark Fix Studios, and today we're going to be talking about G Suite. And what G Suite is, is that it is a set of Google tools that you can use whenever you sign up, mainly with a domain, and have email, you can access calendars, just all sorts of stuff, as well as YouTube. Starting on uh, what used to be June 1st, is now extended to June 27th is going to uh, change to a paid subscription. And it's about $6 and something cents per month for your subscription, and that's per account. So if you're like me with my other account, which I've already done this to, I had, I think it was 15 accounts inside of that one. Now, a majority of these accounts are mine. One is goes to my mother, one goes to my son, goes to my daughter-in-law, and then one is for my grandchildren. It is not a company per se account, but it goes to my website nonetheless. And then we have this account, which is Dark Effects. Now, the Dark Effects account is what we're going to be working on today. And this right here is my admin panel, and I have not logged into this thing in years. I'm talking, it has been at least five, six years since I logged into it, but luckily, I had a recovery email that allowed me to recover my account because I, the phone number that was attached to it no longer exists and I couldn't remember. But anyway, so what we're doing here is we've got a choice. We can either pay the $6 and something a month, which as you can see, this account has nine active users. We can either pay the $6 and something cents a month per user so if we come over here and we open up our calculator, bring it over here. So we got, let's just say it's $6.99 a month. And then we times that by nine. It's going to cost us $62.91 a month if we keep all of these users and we use the new Google platform, which is the Google Workspace. So it's changed from the G Suite to Google Workspace. Using the Google Workspace, like I said, it's going to cost you $62.91 a month if you have nine active users. So that's $6.99 per user. Now, there is a way to get around this. And I found this out thanks a lot to a friend of mine on Expert Exchange uh, named Scott Fellow, who told me that he thinks there's a way around it. And there is a way around it. And what that is, that we come over here and it says upgrade from G Suite Legacy Free Edition, which is what we have been using for years. But it basically tells you that you got until June 27th to start using the new workspace and no longer use G Suite. And then it's at no cost from June 27th to August 1st. That still doesn't help out people like me. I mean, I don't make a lot of money off from my domains right now, so I cannot afford to dump that much money into Google every single month whenever I'm not making a lot of money off from it. But then we come down here. What if I use G Suite Legacy Free Edition for personal use? And that's pretty much what people like me are doing. We're not using the G Suite for an organization. It's not being used for a school. It's being used for personal use. Now, if I start making a lot of money and start hiring people on, then that is whenever I'm going to want to go in and purchase this if I'm not already running everything in-house, which is what I want to do anyway, is I want to run everything in-house. It's just that I cannot change nothing over because it's part of an organization. So on this link right here, which is going to be in the, the description below, we're going to come down here. It says, if you're using the G Suite Legacy Free Edition for non-commercial purposes, which is what we're doing, you can opt out of the transition to Google Workspace by clicking here. Requires a super administrator account. So you got to make sure that you are seeing what you're seeing right here. You got to be able to see this right here. This lets you know that this account is the super administrator administrator account. For a super administrator account or going to the Google admin console, you can continue using the custom domain with Gmail, retain access to no cost Google services such as Google Drive and Google Meet and keep your purchases and data. 
If you don't take any action, your account will be suspended starting on August 1st. To reactivate your account, you will either need to upgrade to Google Workspace or opt out of the transition for non-commercial use. And that's what we're going to do here. So we're going to go ahead and click this link right here. And then we're going to choose this one right here. And it's going to pop up this dialog right here. Now it says business use upgrade to Google Workspace for $3 a month per user a month starting August 25th. So this, okay, it, it was $6 a month. So we come over here, we clear this, we do six times nine, and that's $54 a month that I would have to pay. And then we times that by 12, and then we get $648 is how much that would cost me a year. And so, which now if we come down here, we clear it, we do three times nine, times and that'll be $27 a month times 12 is $324 a year like I said if I get to where my business is growing and I'm making a lot of money off from YouTube and a lot of money off of my websites then I will go in and change this to business use right now it's just me I don't have anybody working for me it's just myself so we're going to come down here we're going to choose personal use stay at no cost legacy g suite click here and then it says right here continue using your custom domain and gmail retain access to no cost google services keep your personal sorry keep your purchases and data this option is for non-commercial personal use google may remove business functionality from this offering and transition businesses to google workspace additionally this option will not include support. Go ahead and click on confirm for personal use. And there we go. Thank you for choosing. You have chosen to continue using the free legacy edition of G Suite for personal use. If you change your mind and want access to premium features, you can take advantage of the special discount by upgrading your subscription to the Google admin console. And so that's what we would do once I start making a lot of money and then I'm going to need something as a tax write-off. All right, that's it. So now we no longer have to worry about the worry of having to pay because we're set up with the free edition. I am Wayne Barron for Dark Effect Studios. So now we're all set up. Y'all have a good one now. Bye-bye.